Hi guys, it's Regina and I'm back with another mini. And I actually made this mini back in November for my girlfriend. It was for her birthday party. And it's a musical theme. And I made it for her because she books different musicians. And um, I thought it would be perfect for her. And uh, I was totally inspired by Bona. Bona had made um, a mini and it's actually out of uh, envelopes. And it's this scallop envelope die by Stampin Up. So this is what it looks like. And then you just fold it and make a mini out of it. And uh, once it's folded, you can just add inserts. So here we go. The paper collection that I use is by DCWV. And then for the chipboard embellishments, this is actually by Can Company. And this was so much fun to make. I love how it came out. And my girlfriend loved it. So here we go. I just put some ribbon on the side. And right here is a Tim Holtz fragment, and I use the glossy accents to cover it over uh, the paper, and it was perfect. It fit perfect with this uh, little guitar, and it's hung from a garment pin, the Making Memories garment pin. And then I use my Seven Gypsies um, hole puncher to punch the holes. Can't think of what it's called right now. And then I just use the black extra or the black large eyelets <clears throat> in the center, excuse me. And then um, along the edges of the paper I distress them with the black soot distressing ink and then I use the black diamond uh, stickles around the edge just to make it pop a little. And then these are some more of uh, the Heidi Swap Ghost Wings and I put some stickles and diamond over them to make them shine a little. And then I added the glossy accents on top of the guitar just to make it shiny. And then on the inside, this is just a Mara Johnson rock and roll stamp that I used um, embossing ink over. And I used that jelly roll embossing powder that I love. And then it's also been, uh, each of the pages have been glimmer mess with marshmallow. <clears throat> Excuse me, glimmer mess. And then on this paper, this is that sanded embossed tarot paper. So I ran this through my uh, one of my Cuddlebug folders, embossing folders, and that's what created the circles. And then the, here are some stars, chipboard stars that are the Kane Company. And then this is the actual envelope right here. And then this is another Kane Company uh, chipboard piece. And then for the eyes, I just put my own little pink bling. And then here is the insert so that she can journal on it. And um, this is also that sanded embossed tarot paper. And again, I ran it through a different Cuddlebug embossing folder. And so uh, the paper is black on top and then pink um, on the bottom. So then when you sand it, the pink shows through. And then this is the other side. And these are some Prima flowers. And I just painted the edges and added this little uh, Prima piece in the center. And then I just added um, her name, J-E-N, with some rhinestones. And then this is another Mar Johnson uh, stamp that I stamped on acetite, uh, acetate. And then I just cut out the shape. And it's been embossed as well. And it says Rockstar. And then again, another insert. And then on this side, this is a stamp, and it's actually by um, Autumn Leaves. It's this set. Really cute. It's called Girl Talk. So I embossed this, and then I uh, cut it out. And um, she can add her own journaling there. And then on this side, I love this. This is a Prima piece, the skull with the wing. And then these were Prima letters also that spell out star. And on the back side, I uh, just added some glossy accents over the guitar to make it pop a little. And then these are just some musical note brads. I love brads. And then again, here's that sanded Boston and Tarot paper, and I ran it through my uh, embossing folder. I believe this is the Argyle one. And then right here, I love this one that says Queen Bee. This is another Kane Company chipboard piece. And then here's another one. So I added some glossy accents over this part of the lipstick. And then this is a Karen Foster Brad Bling. Really pretty. 
And then this again is also another uh, Mara Johnson stamp that I uh, stamped and embossed and cut around. And then I just added rhinestones to the crown. And then this is another um, Prima uh, sticker. And I actually added the crackle accents to make it crack. So that came out really cute. And then on the back, this is uh, Anna Griffin uh, Crown Brad. And I added it over the chipboard piece. And again, I put the glossy accents over the love part. And then this is a envelope that I die cut from um, one of my dies out of vellum. And then I embossed the edges. And I also distressed the edges. And then I used my um, one of those punches to punch out the shape at the top. And again, it has a journaling spot. And then on this side, um, here's that sanded Boston and Tarot paper again, and I ran it through a different die. Um, I'm sorry, embossing folder. And then I just made a pocket here, and it just has two tickets for some more journaling. And then on the back, it just has Heidi Swap, um, the clear pieces that uh, say happy birthday. And I uh, just signed the back. And so. That's my mini. I hope you guys like it. And it was so much fun to make. So if you guys have that die, you should give it a try. A lot of fun to make. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye.